Hey guys, it's Old School Gamer, uh, bringing you a video today. Um, this is actually a video I've been wanting to do for a while, and uh, so I'm just getting around now to doing it. Um, yeah, I haven't made a video in a while, about three weeks actually, so sorry about that. Um, so yeah, this I think you guys will like this one. Um, uh, I've seen other people do them on YouTube, and I've watched all the ones I could find, so I figure I'm going to do one. This is uh, going to be what's in my bag, my what I carry around with me every day. Uh, I think these videos are interesting. I don't know about you guys, but I've always wanted to do one, so I'm going to do one now. So this is the bag that I take to school with me every day, um, or if I go somewhere big, um, I take it with me. But yeah, this is like my everyday bag, so I'm going to show you guys what all is in it, what I carry with me. Hopefully you guys will like it. So first the bag itself. Um, this is a this is a yak pack. You can see there. It's a like kind of a messenger bag, satchel type thing. I can get a better view of it. Here's the strap. Um, it's got it's made out of uh, canvas, very um, durable, heavy canvas. So I like it. It's pretty rugged, but it looks cool too. So you can see it's got a red and a red plaid design, and it's pretty tough. The only thing, the only complaint I have about it is over here on this strap. I see I put clips on it because on this strap here it like bunches up when I wear it because sometimes I put too much stuff in. And uh, this, you know, let's take these off. This strap ends up scrunching up to one side, but that's really the only thing I can think that's bad. Uh, it's like a medium sized bag, so there's not a lot of room in it, but I usually don't carry that much stuff with me. Um, so yeah, we'll go over the outside pockets. In this pocket on the side here, I just have my calculator for school. It's a really old Texas Instruments. And then on this side is my MacBook uh, Power Block ma mag safe. Can, can get it out. There you go. That's my mag safe for my MacBook. Uh, so, sometimes I don't carry this with me, but um, I have been lately. And then in this pocket, on the front, there's a big pocket. And here I have. Um, my notebook for my English class and some other papers. I, this is a thing for the college I'm going to. So there's just papers in there. I have a keychain that lights up. <laughs> Oops, where's the button? There you can see. It's got like three different things. Yeah, random. Alright, and then you open it up. There's a big clip here and it's Velcro. And it opens up, and I'll try and go from the most boring stuff on. So first, I usually don't carry this with me every day, but I have been. This is my yearbook for school that I just got. Um, yeah, or annual, whatever you want to call it. Um, this I carry with me all the time. It's like a binder type thing, more like a portfolio, but basically um, I have all the handouts and stuff for all my classes in one thing. They're all separated in, in these little um, slots for your papers. So it's kind of a portfolio thing. And I have all the handouts. That way, even if I forget my book or something at school, I always have like the handouts for the classes. So I should be able to do the homework. Like if I need to write a paper or something, they're all in there. And then I have some pens and stuff, pens and pencils for class. And on the back pocket of this thing, I have my... Um, like school agenda what I write down all my assignments in sometimes okay and then the fun part oh, this is my laptop case this is where I keep my MacBook in it's uh, I actually just got this it's brand new this case it's a uh, icon no not icon solo I believe it's made by the company solo and I just got it, 
and it's also a heavy canvas. As you can see, it's got a cool kind of um, also plaidish design to it, and it looks really nice, and it's uh, really pretty heavy duty. And I'll go inside it and show everything. So in the top pocket, uh, I have, because I'm a big geek, I carry around the latest issue of Game Informer in there in the little pocket. So yeah, in this big in this big compartment you have two two pockets that are kind of separated separated by a flap here. So I have the magazine on one side and the other I have my computer. And some people might call me a freak, but I carry my computer a case inside the case. This is like my old case. This is what I used to carry my laptop in, just this sleeve. And this actually came with the MacBook when I bought it. This is a second skin microfiber folder for the MacBook. It says MacBook Air, but I just keep my MacBook in here for the 13 inch. And it's like really skin tight for the Mac, so it really doesn't provide a lot of protection. There's my computer in there with Pikachu on it. So I put, I put the MacBook in here, and then I put the sleeve inside the, the, the actual laptop bag thing. So that's all that's in there. This is a really nice case too, I'd recommend it. Then it has this front pocket. And there's a ton of stuff in here. I'm going to show you guys. Um, on the right side I have my DS. So I always have it in case I want to play games or something on the go. Here I have um, another pen, a pencil, and then a screwdriver. And this is one of those ones that you can like uh, switch around. This part comes out so it can be there. Uh, flathead or Phillips really comes in handy if you want to like replace batteries or something I can't tell you how many times I've needed a screwdriver and didn't have one and then this pocket is crammed with stuff so I'm going to have to pull it all out um, this is in no really order of relevance or anything so I have a headphone splitter um, could always use one of these at times I have iPod cord, which I use for my iPhone to charge it, or if I want to put a song on it or something at school. A stylus for, like, no reason, basically. I don't know what I need this for. I just keep it in there. It's like a pen-sized stylus. Uh, book light. Very bright book light. Again, I don't really know what I'd need this for. I guess it's just in case I do need it. It's in there. This could come in handy. This is a mini mag light. In case I ever need a uh, little flashlight. If I'm looking around in like my bag at night or looking for the keyhole on my door or something. This is really nice. This is a um, uh, all-in-one card reader, basically. Yeah, all-in-one card reader. Uh, it has like SD, uh, memory stick, memory stick duo with adapter and micro SD so it's pretty small it was really cheap it was like five bucks or something and uh, you just pop this off and you got the USB and uh, it comes handy if I'm gonna like get something off my camera um, sorry if the video goes up a little bit over ten minutes guys because I'm already at nine here I have my headphones always need these in case I want to listen to music I'm a huge music buff, so always got to have my iPhone headset. Then this also comes in handy a lot. This is a four-port uh, four USB hub that I use with my MacBook. This is actually the USB hub that came with my Rock Band game, video game, when I bought it. As you can see, it's got Rock Band on the back, but I use it for my computer because it's small and it fits really well into the bag. So there you go, four port USB hub. And uh, it's also USB 2.0. I have another USB, uh, another USB hub, but it's not 2.0, so everything's slower, I think. Um, this is my DS flash cart. It's a TTDS. Um, I'm not gonna explain what it does. If you guys know, then yeah. Microfiber cloth. Uh, another thing a geek should like always have in his bag is a 
something to clean his screens with. And finally, my thumb drive, you know, for transferring data and stuff. So you can see this is kind of interesting story. See, it's all scratched up. This actually, I washed this. It got stuck in the washing machine and got like chopped up and stuff a little bit. And uh, I took it out and I was like, oh, there's no way it works. And I put it in and I still had all my data intact. So this thing went through a full wash cycle and dry cycle and survived. This is the uh, SanDisk Cruiser Micro, I believe. Yeah, Cruiser Micro 2 gig flash thumb drive. So yeah, guys, that's uh, that's what I carry around with me every day. Um, hopefully that was a pretty interesting video for you guys. Um, another thing, just so I can keep pumping out videos for you guys, I'm not necessarily going to promise a, like, review or anything, uh, you know, every, like, week or something, because it's just, I don't have that much stuff to review, and I can't keep buying things, um, but I am going to start, like, vlogging, just like me sitting in front of the camera talking about, you know, random, random video game, electronics, whatever stuff. So yeah, I'm going to start vlogging a lot, or vlogging, whatever you guys want to call it. Uh, if you guys think that's a good idea, then, you know, tell me. Or, uh, also, any suggestions, if, uh, anything else you think I should be carrying in my bag that I might need. Um, I'll also mention, I don't carry this with me all the time, but sometimes I do. Uh, this is a Microsoft wireless mouse. But, um, it, it doesn't quite fit in here very well, so I d usually don't carry it all the time. It usually stays on my desk. Okay, so, yeah, guys, that was the, my uh, What's in My Bag video. I hope you guys liked it. Uh, this is Old School Gamer. See you guys later. Bye.